Toad's Place, one of the oldest and well-known music clubs in the country. Name a band or artist in the past half century and chances are they have appeared at Toad's. I don't think there's any major band in the world that didn't come to this club. Like the Rolling Stones surprise performance before their Steel Wheels tour. Toad's, great memories of playing there with the Stones. Or Bob Dylan performing four and a half hours, his longest concert ever at this musical wonderland in New Haven, Connecticut. Billy Joel recorded a live track for his songs in the Attic album at Toad's. Artists like Dave Matthews, Sheryl Crow, and U2, among many others, started their careers at the famed Lily Pad. You can see the history, you can smell the history, you can feel it. Musical memories and milestones. Toad's has hosted over 75 members of the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame, like Bruce Springsteen, Bon Jovi, Muddy Waters, Bonnie Raitt, David Bowie, and Santana, to name a few. Toad's is a veritable who's who of the music world. From Kenny G to Cardi B, B.B. King to Queen Latifah, Stray Cats to Snoop Dogg. Toad's Place, the hottest place in Connecticut. It's small, but it has a compact vibe. In 2015, USA Today voted Toad's the number one small venue in the country. As musical taste changed, Toad's embraced the new sounds of an evolving music industry. Without a space like Toad's, what would we have? These are the things that help us do it for the love and do it for the culture. If you love music, here's a backstage pass to legendary performances in Toad's Place, the documentary.